This is an ECHO 2021 General Mathematics Paper 2 and we are answering question number 1A and the question reads uh, without using mathematical tables you ask to find the value of log to base of 6 plus log to base of 45 minus log to base of 27 it is this that you are now asked to find it is value but without using mathematical tables. So let's attempt to answer this very question together. Solution to the problem, what you do first is to copy the given task. Log to base of 6 plus log to base of 45 minus log to base of 27. This is what we asked to find it is value. To find this value without using mathematical table, what you need to do is to apply the law of logarithm. So this is now equals to log to base 10. Because these three logs have base 10, base 10, base 10 each, so you can apply the log logarithm. So this will now be equals to log to base 10, then you open a bracket. Inside the bracket will now be 6 multiplied by 45. This 6 multiplied by 45 is a result of adding log 6 and log 5, which the law says you now multiply 6 by 5 and divide it by 27. And this division by 27 is from the law which says if you are subtracting the log, you now divide by the number. So you now have log to base 10 of 6 multiplied by 45 divided by 27. So our work now reduces to simply find what is inside this bracket first. So 6 multiplied by 45 gives answer to 70. You copy down your denominator which is 27. So you now have 270 divided by 27. And this division, if done correctly, you now have 10. So you have log to base 10 of 10. And another law says if the base of the log and the number is the same, simply take it as 1. So this log to base 10 of 10 will now be equals to 1. And this answer to this very question. Let me just share with you quickly the mark distribution for this very question as it is done in the marking scheme. So the very first mark is the method one mark, and this method one mark is for applying the law of logarithm. Instead, adding log 6 and log 45 minus log 27, you now have log to base 10 of the product of 6 and 45, then you divide the result by 27. So applying this law correctly, you have this method one mark. And when you now have the final value as 1, you have this accuracy one mark. So if everything is correct, this question will now give you two good marks.